When working in the ADP Studio, you will likely find that your machine is already threaded. This requires you to change the color of the thread for each project you're working on. The easiest way to do this is by practicing tying off the thread on your machine. We're going to be changing the color of the thread on this machine from white to black. And we do this by first placing, removing your white thread from the spool holder and placing your new thread on the spool holder. Now, we want to make sure that we leave enough slack in the thread so that we don't just lose the thread from our first guide. So in order to do this, you do not want to cut close to your guide, but give yourself a little bit of thread to work with and cut your previous color thread before your first thread guide. Picking up your new thread color, our black thread, you're going to want to create a very simple knot. And you can do this by pairing your two tails together and creating a loop and inserting both tails through the center of that loop and pulling gently, creating a very small knot. At this point, you can move back towards the base of your machine into your needle. Now the knot you just created will not go through the needle hole. So you can unthread your needle eye. From here, you can begin to gently pull on the previous color thread. And you will notice that we now have our thread moving through our thread guides. Go slowly to ensure that your knot does not break. If your knot does break, you can retie the two thread ends. When reaching a tension plate, you might notice that you will feel some tension. You can move your knot through by gently lifting the plate away, and that gives a little bit more room for the knot to pass through the tension plates. Continue to pull your thread so that you no longer have your previous color visible. At this point, you can clip your thread and insert it through your needle from left to right.